guys welcome back to my channel so I'm back here again I wanted to talk about the glam glows and just my honest uh, opinion about them and I also have a recommendation for you guys that I think you should really try if you guys hear any background noise I have the window open because it's like 90 degrees in here in New York where I live and it's too hot to not have my window open Anyway, so with the Glam Glow, I know they came out a little while ago, but I've been using them for a few months, and I wanted to come on here and tell you guys my honest opinion of them. So, around Christmas time last year, they were having this set, and it came with the Thirsty Mud, the Exfoliator, and then there's the white one for acne treatments, I believe. Um, I'm done with the white the white one so I can only speak about these two but I do have an opinion about the white one that set was $69 so I never tried Glam Glow before and I decided why not I actually got it around the time that they had the VIB sale so before Black Friday before uh, December I think it was around November 15th or something I'm not too sure so I ended up buying it I got 20% off of it which was great um I've been using it for the past few months, so I'll start off with the blue. This is the Thirsty Mask. It's supposed to help with those that have dry skin. I love this. This is amazing. It smells really good. It smells like coconut butter. Oh my god. This is what it looks like. And as you can tell, I've been loving it. I've been using this like crazy. I might just have like maybe four or five masks left in it. And I know some people were complaining about the size because this alone is $69 and it's only 1.7 ounce. But in my opinion, a, a little goes a really long way. I've been having this, I've been using this since December and we're now in May and I have to get a refill. So that speaks volumes. Like, it's amazing. I love the blue one. I mean, I have really dry skin and I have to be careful with what kind of foundations I use and what kind of blushes I put on my face because it'll pick up my dry patches. This has, this has been helping a lot. I literally use this every night. It says to use it two, three times a week, but I use it every night, every day. I usually just use the Philosophy Purity, um, I think it's just like a face wash and I just... I use that and then when I go to sleep I'll use this and it's amazing and I, you know this is not like a mask where when you go to sleep you feel like it's on you it's like it just absorbs it so quick into my skin so love this okay so I also have like a little mini sample of the youth mug tingle exfoliate treatment I like this too the only thing I have to say about this is that there's like chunks in here so when you put it on your face you get chunks of it that's the only thing I don't like about this but besides that I really do feel like my skin is very exfoliated when I use it and it smells it smells very pepperminty I mean mine is a little dried up because I haven't been using it but I'll show you guys that's what it looks like and with this mask and with the white mask that I'm going to talk about in a minute, uh, it'll, like, it, this mask, it actually, like, it gets hard on your skin. With the blue uh, Thirsty Mud, it doesn't, it's more, like, soothing, like, it feels, it feels great. But with this one, like, you could feel when you have it on your face. You should only have this on for like 15 minutes. I know people that leave it on longer, but I, after 10 minutes, I'm like, okay, I need to take this off because it gets hard and it, you know, once you take it off, you just, you know, like soften your face. It just feels amazing. So I like this one too. Okay, I physically don't have the white one on me, the white mask, but it came in the same size. I personally did not like the white mask. I know some people here on YouTube, I think it's called the Power Mud. I know some people on YouTube love it and people go on and on about it and that's great. But for me, I don't like it. I didn't like the smell. It literally made me nauseous. So I try to just use up as much as I can. I even tried it to put some on my boyfriend because I was like, uh, yeah, you can use this. Like, I just... I didn't like it. I, I do have acne prone skin so sometimes I usually get them under um, 
my chin, sometimes on my nose, but I just, it just wasn't for me. I just didn't like it. I didn't see it really doing anything, but that's just, you know, my opinion. So that's how I feel about the three mask. I do have a cleanser to show you, but my opinion on the mask is that if you are to just buy one, like if you were like, Natalie, I'm going to Sephora, which one should I get? I'm going to say get the Glengal Thirsty Mud. It's amazing. It's perfect for those that have dry skin. I know some people that have oily skin that have used it too. It's great. If you really want to see like your skin to be nurtured and just, it just feels amazing. It feels I just, I know I keep saying amazing, 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 but it really does. Like, I think it does the job very well. I've noticed a change in my skin. I've noticed my dry spots are not as dry. You know, it's just, I'm always going to have dry skin, but I just noticed a difference with this. And I think you guys should definitely try this if you are going to go to Sephora. I know it's $69. I would try to get it with uh, one of the sales, like, to be honest, I'm trying to wait until the VIB sale this November because it is $70. It is pricey, but if you have it, I think you should definitely go get it. They also have this in like a mini size at Sephora now. They have it for um, $19. And I know they also have another mask, the green one. I haven't tried that one, but I wanted to come on here and talk to you guys about the three masks. So my recommendation is you should definitely get this mask. It's amazing, especially if you have dry skin. You'll go to sleep and when you wake up, it feels like you have new skin. That's why I use this every single night. So that's my thought on this. Okay. So they also came out with some cleansers. I think they came out with last year. I got it in the blue one. This is Mud to Foam. It feels like once you pump it out, it kind of looks like shaving cream, the bottle. So it's like once you uh, pump it out, first of all, a little goes a long way. I've had this for months also. I think I got this in January or February when it came out. It came out this year. Um... This is great too. This is $39, so it is $30 cheaper than the mask. This, it does come out like a mud, like almost like the mask, and then you just add water and you just, you know, just exfoliate your face. And it does become a little foamy, not too foamy. They also have this one in the white the, for the Power Mud, the black, which I would love to get, the exfoliator. And they have it in the green. I have not tried the other ones. I've only tried this one. This is another product that I think you should get. Um, it also does help you if you have makeup on. With me, when I used foundation in this, the winter time, when I used foundation and I was ready to take it off, I'll just use a makeup wipe and then I would use this with my purity. And then to go to sleep, I would use this Glam Glow. And it's like those three are like a perfect team. It literally takes off all your makeup. I love this product. It's a great cleanser. I will keep buying this product. I will keep buying this Clam Glow. I mean, they're amazing. For $39, I think it's worth it. Again, like, even if you wanted to use this as a mud, you can. You can also leave this on your face for a little bit and then use the water to, you know, get it completely off. I like this product. So... I had a recommendation for you guys. I'm a really big fan of Lush. And this is one of the masks that I like. There's another one that I like that I'm currently testing out for a little while longer. And I'll come back on my channel and talk to you guys about it. But this one is the Mask of Magnety for face and body. It's packed full of peppermint, cologne, and scrubby beads for deeply cleansed skin okay so I think this is worth it this was from Lush and I bought this for $12 it's green and I'll show you guys and I've had this for a few months and as you can see it's still packed it smells really good it smells like peppermint like love it and I paid $12 for this they have two different size excuse me two different size this is a 4.4 ounce and they also have, I think, a 12.8 ounce. I'm not too sure. But I got this from Lush. 
What I was going to say about showing this in my video is that I know people go crazy about the Glam Glow and the Glam Glow is $69. I honestly think you should pick this up. This is only $12 and it does a better job than the Glam Glow. This is just my personal opinion. I feel like if you do suffer from acne prone skin, I think you guys should try this. Again, this is the Mask of Magnity. This is amazing. Lush has amazing products and... I just, I just, oops, <laughs> I, I love them, like as you can tell, I knocked down my Glam Glow, I love this mask, I've used it multiple times, it's great for, like, if you need, like, a touch-up, if you see, oh, I have a bump, oh my god, like, you just put a little bit on there, literally, two or three, day, two, two or three days later, it'll be gone, I used one on my boyfriend recently, maybe, like, two weeks ago, he had like a little bump and I put a little bit on it and then when I saw him like two days later it was gone. I don't know. I think this is amazing. I think that if you have acne prone skin I think you should try this. It's cheaper and it's a better mask than the other Glam Glow. That's just my opinion but you guys go in store and try it. And uh, again this is called the Mask of Magnity and this is what it looks like. And what's good also about Lush just in case you guys didn't know. If you have four more of these containers you could go to the store and you could get a free um mask i think you get a smaller version of it but that's still a really good deal so this is my recommendation for um an acne pro mask so that's it thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this review i just wanted to come on here and talk about glam glow i know a lot of people have tried it some people haven't like i said these are just my recommendations if you were to go into the store i would definitely grab this cleanser because it's amazing and i would grab the blue one um i think my second favorite one would be the black tingling sensation the only thing i don't like like i said that it's very chunky in the you know this little container like i just don't like that it's so chunky like when you put it on your face but i'm not going to keep rambling i hope you guys been enjoying my video that's my review and i hope you guys stay uh cool because in new york it is so hot it feels like we're ready in summertime but i love you guys and i'll see you later